I'm back in the Austal Smash Nova 330. Still don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but uh, doing another contract, doing some harvesting. Completely and utterly messed up my last one doing the bailing. Um, basically bailed a load of grass, so uh, <laughs> not great. But um, I definitely need to get better understanding what I'm meant to be doing because I don't want to keep doing that. But I've got to get some more money together, so I've had to keep doing some contracting I know I can do the harvesting so I'm just thought I'd crack on with this it's a nice nine grand as well so um, didn't have to borrow the items because we got all the stuff um, and I'm still not bankrupt got 29 grand I've got enough to get a plow so I want to get a plow at some point can I make this turn oh, 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 oh. not bad not bad I like that one yeah I got want to get a plow sorted um, I want to plough up the potato field, it's all withered now anyway, and obviously I messed up the topping. <laughs> but going to plough that up, just replant that as um, wheat or barley probably. And then the um, beet field, which is what come with the yard, I want to plough it up and turn it into grassland and uh, be able to make hay with it. Because I really enjoyed it last on the last episode, even though I messed it up, I did enjoy doing the process. Um, and also later on I really want to get a silage clamp or one of the anaerobic digesters or find out how that stuff works, that'd be cool. So if we're going to need grass, I want to do that and also be able to use it um, after we've got more land hopefully um, as a pasture for cattle or whatever, any kind of livestock and get some animal farming on the go as well. But either way I need to get some more money. Um, I've got my little fent over here with a trailer behind it. Thought I'd have a change from the um, ST Max 180. Oh boy. I'm seeing getting the hang of it now, look. And um, this will, like I said, be a nice quick 9k, hopefully. Um, I can get, I found out I can get more money out of the bank, which I didn't know. But um, I can't see how much my repayments are each day or however they do it, the payments and um, obviously I don't want to be throwing money away constantly I want to try and make money so um, I'm going to hold off on that for now because uh, you start already owing the bank like nearly 300 grand I think it is but yeah we'll crack on and see what we can get done and hopefully stop the farm from going under that's the main thing anyway I'm gonna get this field harvested I'm gonna jump out of this in a minute and jump in the fence and do the carting and let one of the workers carry on with this Open. He's only ready for a uh, load. Oh, he's already stopped. Don't like doing this, but not got much choice here. Ooh. Right, might as well wait for a full load. up here ready to turn around for her so I ain't got to wait. <laughs> I actually really like this off it looks pretty smart. I need to get the uh, front loader attachment for it to save me having to buy an actual loader for the um, bailing and stuff when we get around to it ourselves. I need a pressure washer, got to get the tractors clean. This is harder in first person when you're not looking where you're going. <laughs> yeah, it's still not full.
right, the silo thing should be here somewhere. Is it in here? Oh, here we go, this must be in. Yeah, there's the round track on the other side. You know what, this is taking ages. I wonder if I can... Uh, I'll get, get her unloaded and um, see how much it puts in the um, trailer. I'm just wondering whether it's worth going to get the plough with my other tractor and then start ploughing that field outside my farm and just keep jumping back here to check on how she's doing. <laughs> I think that might be the way to do it. Hire another worker to jump in the plough while um, while I'm running this. Yeah, I'll go and park this back up here and then I'll, I think we'll buy the little plough and start ploughing them fields up and see what happens. The only thing I'm worried about is uh, ploughing them too early and not, and by the time I get to do anything with them, I have to plough them again. But um, it's got two chances, isn't it? So, plough, leave that there. Okay, I think this plough is going to be the one we get. It's uh, 14 grand, and two and a half metres. So it's 0.5 metre longer than the first one. And every little bit of um, coverage will help, I think. So, because these ones are massive, and we ain't got anywhere near enough money for them. But I think this will be fine for now. So we'll get it and have a go of it. Wonder what they do. We'll just leave them standard. I don't know what they're doing, I don't want to waste money any more than I already am. <laughs> Alright, get it. Yes, okay. Here we go. Oh, that is a uh, tiny compared to the other one we were using the other week. Oh, wow. Not bad. Before I do anything here, I'll uh, check the progress on the other one. 72%. Alright, let's get her emptied. Right, that only uh, took me to 60%, so I'll go park this back down the field and uh, start ploughing up the potato field. <laughs> right, so, uh, really messed up my ploughing the other day, <laughs> but hopefully I've got, yeah, I've got an idea of um, what I need to do, hopefully I'm right. Just lower it there. I just need to remember at the end I can turn the plough over. <laughs> turn that over. Oh yeah. There we go. See, I am learning, I'm learning. Get this down. Uh, and off we go. There we go. 
Well, we've got this underway now, so I'll jump out and let uh, another worker do this. Hopefully it's going to be worth the money. Um, I was just thinking what I might do then is see how much it will cost to lease the stuff to um, plant and cult well, cultivate plant, weed and all that stuff so we can get something growing um, for ourselves. But um, yeah, I'll get a worker in here. There we go. And uh, oh, what's she on? 57. We're multitasking now, we're getting somewhere. I feel like that's a good decision, <laughs> I hope it is. It's got to get ploughed, we we're need. we going to need a plough. Um, it's going to be a while before we can get a big one, so I was going to have to get a small one anyway, so I think that's the right decision there. Um, and as soon as I've done this contracting, I'm going to look up what I need to do to seed that all properly and, and like I said, get our own crops growing and start cultivating and farming our own stuff as well as the contracting and uh, I'm definitely going to plough that other field and get, get it turned into grass so we can get to making that hay oh boy and then what I think I'll do is as much as I want to try out the other stuff um, to earn us a bit extra money, I'll just keep doing the harvesting contracts to make money, which I probably won't show you, this will probably be the last one for a little while, I don't want to keep just doing harvesting. Um, and once we've got the mowing and stuff, I'll, and then once we've got all the mowers and the balers and all that stuff, I can start doing that as contracting as well. And uh, I think that's my current plan for a little while. And like I said, the end goal is to get get arable and uh, livestock on the go. I um, really do want to get some cattle or some horses, would be cool. There we go, that's 90% full. Let me know, guys, what you think to the series so far. If, um, if you're liking the farming simulator, if you're not liking the farming simulator. If you play Farming Simulator and you've got any ideas for me or any tips or whatever, let me know in the comments as well. Um, yeah, just let me know what you think to it. I'm really, really enjoying making these and really enjoying playing the game, obviously. Uh, and I hope you guys enjoy watching it. Hopefully the more I go on through the game and the more knowledge I know about it, the better it will be. And like I said, I'm using Felsbrin just to cut my teeth and really get to grips with the game, to be honest. And then I would like to um, get onto one of the other maps, one of the custom maps on, in Britain or something, would be cool. She on speed. <laughs> Look at her eyes. Wow. She's wide awake.
this is this is nearly done now, so I'll swap into this. Where's uh And I'm trying to use the mouse and keyboard, so this will be interesting. But I'm trying to save a bit more money, this is nearly done. I'll jump over to where the harvester is when uh, her tank's full. She can do two or three runs before that trailer's filled up, so. How do I turn this over on here? The uh, sound effect for the soil getting turned is satisfying as hell. <laughs> yeah, hopefully you can hear it. No, she's full now. Guys, oh, there's a lot of work. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't think this was going to be this difficult. Forgetting about me, uh, harvester now. <laughs> oh, come on. Probably get this load and wait for another one. Um, and then I'm going to try and see if I can extend that field I was ploughing. If I can, obviously, I'll do the same with that little field that I turn into grass and uh, give myself more grass to be able to mow and turn into hay. I was thinking that I can just mow the grass around my field, but I don't think it actually lets you. I think it has to be within a plot, so. I imagine I'm going to have to extend that little field if I want to do that. That's uh, sorted. Leave that somewhere there. Anyway, I'll get this last row done and then I'll see if I can extend the field. Right. Um, I don't know what the best way to do this is. So we go. Alright, okay, so I'll, I'll just keep going <laughs> as wide as I can until it tells me I've got to stop. And I'll go as far down as I can as well. And then we'll know the length of what we got. Obviously. And then, like I said, I think I'll do the same with that little field there then, and then when I seed it's grass, I'll have a nice big area, because I don't think I can actually mow that grass there. So I'll just keep going down for now, see where it tells us to stop. Oh, interesting, I can go all the way down here. Do I even own that? Oh, I do. Oh, I didn't know that. Hang on a minute, what's this little cabin then? Okay, nothing there. Wow, well, that means I've got a little login I can do as well. well I didn't realise that, that's a nice little turn, that means it goes all the way down there. So I could potentially extend all of this 